So you can see they're, they're already starting to sprout and root, so I gotta get these bad boys in the ground. So this hole's already been opened up by the tool. Some of these are kind of small, so because I'm making a really thick spot here for them, I just set, set these rhizomes. I got some with some shoots. Cover them back up. Get that root weed out of there. And there I go. Well, I have gotten two rows staggered of 100 rhizomes in. So this will be a permanent pinch point. And what this will do is divide the uh, clover chicory blend from the soybeans over here. And of course, bedding area right in there. Well, this is Jake from Habitat Solutions. I'm out here just clipping the top of my uh, clover chicory plus field. Off. I'm starting to get some weeds that are coming up and blossoming but I can't believe how many deer beds are in here there's large and then there's small ones so there's been a doe and a couple of fawns in here and I've seen at least six or eight different beds and I haven't made three passes so it's pretty cool that you can grow forage of this quality and just look at the thick the abundant different clovers and the chicory in here and the does and the fawns will use this as bedding because it's tall enough now to give them some cover. I'm only gonna take about a third of this off and leave the other two thirds. Come back in about three, four weeks, take those two thirds. As they say, never take all the food off of the plate. And this field is getting a lot of use right now, so that's my goal.